Hi everyone, this is Srinivas from Amirpet Technologies. In this video, I am going to explain about the for each method in JDK 8 features. So the most important method which is defined in iterable interface as well as in stream API. See the one point we need to understand. For each method is used to process the information of a collection object easily. Right? So either you are performing all streaming operations or you are performing any operation on collection object using JDK 8. So this is the most important method. See for all collection interfaces we know that the top interface is a iterable interface. Iterable interface extended by the collection interface and collection interface is extended by so many other interfaces called list, set, queue, list, set, queue, all other interfaces. See, all collection implemented classes contains a set of objects. What is a collection? A set of objects. We store the complete information in the form of objects only. So to process the information in JDK 8, they introduce the functionality. So now the question is where they have to place. So what is the common area to place the common functionality? This is the common area to place the functionality. But there is a rule what iterable is an interface. Inside the interface, can we define any method which is having the logic? No, it's impossible. This is the main reason they introduced the default methods in interfaces from JDK 8. Just because of for each method only. Right? So before in interface, it is allowed to define only abstract methods. Since JDK 8, it is allowed to define the methods which are having the body. What is the main purpose means what? Just to define the for each method inside the iterable interface. So how iterable interface is present? Inside the iterable interface, inside the iterable interface, they define the default method called for each method. For each, the logic they define. So what is the purpose means what? For each method is easy to process the information of collection object, any collection, a list collection or set collection or dictionary collection. For each method is not only belongs to the iterable interface, it is belongs to that stream class also in stream API. That stream API class is also introduced in JDK 8. So what is the streaming the data? Right? How we are using for each method in streaming also will cover in the coming videos. Hope you understood. Thank you.